Here is my take for the week. Who will tell the president part four? Speaking in China a few days ago with Nigerians based in that country, after an official visit, President Bola Ahmed Tinubu said, and I quote him, China is a very disciplined society, and we have to be disciplined too. Without discipline and commitment, we cannot build a nation that is respected everywhere in the world. End of quote. Now, these are very promising pronouncements by our president. But back here at home, Nigerians are very distressed with the hike in the pump price of petrol. So who will tell the president that the first thing on the way out of this national despondency is for him to take some radical decisions and state publicly some truths about the subsidy? Truth number one that the subsidy removed in May 2023 at its inauguration had to be partially restored a few months after. And the reason that he had to do that was because the pump price went higher than anticipated. And the administration had to intervene to put a little succor for the people. Truth number two, that even right now, that the pump price is upward of 800 naira to 1,200 naira, depending on where you buy it, a liter, government is still providing a little subsidy. Truth number three, that some form of manageable subsidy we have to remain because we just can't let this thing be entirely market-based. Our people cannot afford it as simple as that. Who will tell the president that if it comes clean this way, there is a good chance that Nigerians can start to really listen to him and he can begin to build a trust with the people. Now, the drastic decision that he has to take. Who will tell the president that if he doesn't have the courage to stare the corruption in the oil and gas sector down, highball to eyeball, why is he talking to us about the discipline in China? Let's quote him again. I quote, without discipline, we cannot build a nation that is respected everywhere in the world. Unquote. Who will tell the president that the inefficiencies in the NMPC and the oil and gas sector amount to gross indiscipline? Who will tell the president that the entire nation is urgently waiting on him to discipline that sector, which is the commanding height of our economy? Without the president, once and for all, working to terminate the indiscipline, the corruption, and the inefficiencies in the NMPCL, the hardship the average Nigerian is undergoing we continue unabated and even worsen. And why should he, as president, tolerate such? Who will tell the president to remove subsidy is bold, but to discipline the sector and clean it up is the bolder decision that he has to take? Who will tell the president that if he delays to take the bolder decisions to fight corruption and indiscipline in the sector, the people who voted him into power will continue to carry the body and suffer for a much longer time. But why should they suffer when there is a way out? Finally, who will tell the president that this idea of labeling some of the protesters in last month's end bad governance protest as terrorists and treason suspects? is particularly worried. Are there really serious and compelling evidence that these people being paraded, including the LNC president, have actually committed treasonable offenses? Will there be a diligent prosecution of the case along the lines of terrorism and treason? Who will tell the president that this idea is capable of rubbishing the credentials of Mr. President as a lifelong Democrat? who will tell the president that wittingly or unwittingly, these developments altogether are signaling a legacy he certainly will not be proud of. Let us hope that someone will help us tell the president that as rough and as, as touchy as things are today in Nigeria, there are some Nigerians who still take him very seriously when he makes such remarks like he did in China recently, that, and I quote, I am committed to providing leadership Unquote, it should not fail us. And there you have my take for the week. Inside Sources will be right back. And today we have two segments. Mm -hmm.